It's so exciting to finally be at this point now where we can talk about it because it's been tough to hold this stuff back. Well, that was Rosario Dawson back in April after they premiered the Ahsoka trailer at a Star Wars celebration. Flash forward four months and the first two episodes premiered yesterday and Rosario can't talk about it. With the ongoing SAG after strike, actors aren't allowed to promote their work in any way. So no interviews, no social media posts, no replying to fans, nada. So while Rosario Instagrammed on May 9th of last year, there was day one of shooting the show, Rosario didn't post anything yesterday about the show premiering. So yeah, while Star Wars fans were checking out Ahsoka kicking butt, Rosario wasn't at a Star Wars celebration, but at the Brooklyn Museum, checking out an exhibition for Studio 89 celebration. This is so powerful. This is provocative, exciting, and fun. I can't wait for people to watch it. Well, while Rosario isn't able to talk about the first two episodes, fans certainly are. It's been trending both yesterday, premiere day, and today. The Star Wars crowd seems to be a tough crowd to please, but as I scrolled through the hashtag, the fans seem pleased. Damn, I mean, the first one really starts off really strong. But Rosario said, back at the Star Wars celebration, stay tuned for a later episode. I'll say I, I have a favorite, maybe. <laughs> if you didn't catch that. There might be an episode that I really like a lot. I mean, she showed it again, you should have it by now. I'm not gonna show it to you five times. So nice to deep dive into where they're at emotionally. You have to drop in appearances on The Mandalorian and The Book of Boba Fett. Rosario really enjoyed getting into who Ahsoka is. And now it takes less time to become who Ahsoka is. It was a three hour process when we first started. We have gotten it down now just for at least the makeup to an hour and a half. The whole look is about two hours and it's just remarkable. It's such a team effort, you know, and we're doing it 4.30 and 5 o'clock in the morning. And, you know, just the sort of level of joy and detail. There's also been a tech upgrade on Ahsoka's Montrals from that first appearance on The Mandalorian in 2020. Literally, the technology didn't exist. And that, that didn't, it was always top of mind for us. And I call them the engineers. Like, they were really intense about it and, like, wanting to get it right. And so I'm literally wearing a 3D printed skull cap with, I, I could hear it like bones in my ears as I put it on because it's like the skin. It was designed specifically for our show. Like, it's never existed before. Yeah, the show is breaking new ground. And two episodes in, Rosario said, Just keep flying and lower the rail. Ahsoka is just getting started. She's not finished with her journey. You know, she's still, she might be wiser, but she's not done. And Rosario is hoping the show isn't done after its eight episode run. If you guys love it enough, hopefully we'll get a second season and get to do it again. Without knowing Rosario's thoughts, what are your thoughts on the first two episodes of Ahsoka? We don't pull any punches. I'm just letting you guys know. It's full on. Be prepared. Be prepared.